I put hemp oil on her belly. Hey, beautiful. It's a good way to get contact with her and to get her used to your touch and your smell. Her mum was shot. She was very stressed when she came in. We struggled with her in the beginning. As she grew older and she started to trust, she was playful, definitely nosy. <laughs> Wombats are incredibly nosy. That's their nature. If we change anything or we leave something, it's inspected within the first five minutes. It's pushed over, it's sniffed. If it's a bucket of water, it's emptied. They need to know about any change within their environment. <laughs> yeah, they're in trouble. We got a long road to recovery. Okay. Oh. Wombats need a voice, they need help. In Australia, a lot of them, their mothers are killed on the roads. There's also cruelty. There's a lot of illegal shooting with wombats, which goes unpoliced. Oh, darling. It's okay. <laughs> Come here. So that's the difference. Phil and I are definitely mum. I tend to deal with the younger ones and Phil tends to take them from a certain age. The pinky ones I normally carry on me. I use my body heat and they're with me 24-7. When they get to about 12 to 14 months, they start to become very exploratory and we encourage that by taking them outside where they have burrows and the facilities to do wombat things. Releasing them is definitely the <laughs> ultimate goal. <laughs> Normally I do a bottle every 20 minutes from 6am until midnight. Five o'clock start wombats and then seven o'clock start human children. Changing nappies while wombat plays. It's beautiful, the work is incredible, but there's a lot of heartache involved. I collapse every six months in a heap of tears. We can potentially change bad situations into good. I cannot tell you the feeling you get when you get a wombat in that's been attacked that you can watch grow and thrive. To be able to bring it to the point where it can return to the wild, that's amazing. We're lucky enough to be part of their world for the time that they're in care. I wouldn't, wouldn't swap this life for anything.